Hey, Devin, good to, uh, good to see you in an NBA uh, background there. I'm happy for you. Um, I, I wonder if you could just take me through the roller coaster of like the last two weeks. This, uh, this journey is definitely a grind. Devin Kennedy, rookie from Princeton, signed to a 10-day contract, gets his first NBA point, and his second free throw is good as well. It started way before he, even training camp. He's more of a floater like Steph is. Oh, that. Kennedy! It's just been, you know, um, a story, I think, of resilience. Kennedy for the win. No! Self-believe. It's the basketball in his hands. He is looking to attack. Just knowing that I belong at this stage. Our finals MVP, Devin Kennedy! I know you've been chasing an NBA dream. Now that you're here, what's it like? Another three for Devin. He's got 17 points tonight. He fought hard for that one. That defense was pretty good. Pace is coming back again. Sumner couldn't get it. It's Devin Kennedy. Oh, you, you don't want to look. Oh, seriously, you don't want to look. How's it feeling? It's good. I mean, I woke up today, listened to the new Jet Cole, and was just feeling the vibe. Like, I'm at the three-week mark. Um, yesterday, it got a little swollen from from the flight. I know it's still early on, but, like, I, I mean, it, it feels good. And, I mean, we're just hoping to hear some more good news. We're at my doctor's appointment um, here up in New York, about to meet with Dr. O'Malley one of the best foot ankle doctors um, in the NBA dealing with these sort of things. Um, this is just like the checkup point for three weeks. We're about to go in here, hopefully hear some good news um, so I can get moving and, and get going in this, in this rehab process for physical therapy. And I'll be back out, hopefully hearing good things. So no, I'm excited, man, I'm really excited. It's my birthday. It's my birthday on Friday. I'm screaming nigga Hollywood with me. <laughs> Facts. No, it's all good, bro. <laughs> I'll, I'll link with you. That was my that was like my on court skills coach when I was with Orlando. That's that's Randy. Little homie. So man, we were we were getting in some good work the day that I actually got hurt. And he was telling me, you're starting to get it, it's clicking. Like playing at this level, being a pro, being in the NBA, and specifically being great at what you do. Yeah. I was just getting started. I know. You know. I know. You've been through a lot, man. You've been through a lot of adversity, bro. But this is, I mean, you've overcome more. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's what I told myself when it happened, like in that moment. Bro, I went down and just just right away. Pissed, cause I was yeah. like, Something's broke. I got broke my leg. Yeah. Having those moments with you, yeah. where cats didn't even want to let you get in a pickup game, yeah. you know? It's yeah. gotta feel good for you. Yeah. You know? Yeah. It must feel good. You what know? did they say to you in terms of timeline, the people down there? I mean, so when I went from the ambulance to the hospital and I'm on this, on the little bed, IV, everyone still thinks there's a fracture down there. There's no fracture, right? X ray get the results. We don't see the fraction. We can't see it. So we're gonna get a CT, right? Take me to the CT. Doesn't look like there's a fracture. And everyone's shook because they saw what happened on the floor, bro. This look and they see some damage, obviously, to the ligaments. ligaments. Yeah, but nothing in terms of cartilage wow. and bone. So no fraction. Wow. Just open dislocation. That's insane. Unbelievable. Dude, I've never, honestly, I maybe heard of it maybe once. But and you don't heard. hear about this. I've never heard of it besides that. I mean, come on, bro. I've never heard of it. But you've always been abnormal. <laughs> Facts. You guys know each other from? Play Princeton. Oh! That's my guy, Amir. <laughs> That's what you're saying? Yeah, yeah. yeah he's totally cool. All right. So I was trying to figure out where the, the wound was based on yeah. the video. Yeah. It's a rare injury to get an open ankle dislocation without a fracture. But 
if you 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 judge your ankle sprain on a grade one of ten, what are you like a fifteen? I mean, this freaking thing was sideways, and so if you just do a three sixty around your ankle, this is the tibia talus. That's the ankle joint that looks pretty good. We gotta get you back, like this rehab this summer. So you're back for the fall yeah. and you're selling your camp, right? No one knows that much about this injury because mm -hmm. the open nature of it just throws everyone off. Got you. The priority is getting the wound to heal. And if, if you're okay, you know, like a week or 10 days, I'd let you off the crutches. So you think it looks good? I think it looks very good. And you're not as loose as I thought you were gonna be. You so expected it to be. I expect you to be able to dislocate your ankle. I would stay in the boot for two more, for two or six weeks. Mm -hmm. And that weeks, that gives you six weeks of ligament healing. That's the plan. Awesome. Right. Thank you again. Good, good for you. Nice to nice meet you. Nice to meet you. Let's go. Let's go. Yes, that is the best news you can hear. Yeah. It's really way better than that. He said, oh, way better than next week. Yeah. Stop it. I know. And he said you can go for crutches today, right? <laughs> I don't know if he said all that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if he said all that. <laughs> this feels better already. Take the stitches out. The stitches were the least of the good news, bro. What are you talking about? Man, get your calf right. You can do some PC rehab for this week. I'll put you in contact with the Pacers, people, blah, blah, blah. Taking the train, you want? And next week, you got your full weight burn. Your full weight burn this week. That's fucking awesome. Let's go. All right, bye. Bye. Yes! Man, just got some great news. It was a great appointment. Honestly, I just, I just wanted to get my stitches out and just hear what my next steps were, but we heard more than good news. I mean, he was, he, he, he looked at the ankle, thought it was great. Um, obviously with what the actual injury was and where we're at this point, he, he's honestly amazed. I mean, you can see, you can hear what he said during the video and, 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 and during the appointment. Um, you know, we're, we're looking, we're looking good. We're progressing. We're at week three. Um, the goal now is for me to just start cranking through workouts on this calf so I can be full weight bearing at the four week mark and everyone you know was anticipating six weeks so count my blessings you know i always do you know i give it always up to god um you know the injury was traumatic in itself but i mean we're here right now and we're at three weeks so it was awesome i mean dr o'malley is the best in the business at what he does so i needed to have that conversation that appointment before i get going on to the next thing so i'm about to head back home to indianapolis my birthday's on friday my brother's birthday's on sunday enjoy the time with the family Keep this thing going.